Hi everyone, it's your most favorited person in the world. They're not here right now, so I'm here to replace them. Hey, it's JMT. Today, we're gonna be looking at a new update for running from the internet. Running from the internet update 1.9 is officially out. And by the way, this was like two, three, four days ago. I was going to go ahead and do a video on it. Why is there no volume? Let's have some volume. Is there no music in the game? Oh, oh, there we go. Ooh, ooh. Oh, oh, ah. I absolutely adore running from the internet soundtrack. So running from the internet had a huge update that was added just recently to the game. Their players versus bots has been completely remastered. So we got to go ahead and check that out. It's been a while since we played running from the internet. It's actually been like a month or two. They have two new maps that were added, which I think one is the pit stop, which we're going to enter right now. We'll have to find out what the other one is. They also added the gritty emo that's back in the shop. So if you guys missed out on the gritty action before, you can go ahead and get it today. Let's go ahead and check out what this pit stop map looks like. This map is not that big. How do I get up there? There's a ladder right here. JMT. So obviously this is going to be pretty boring, you know, in a server by myself, but holy Lord, is this map filled with boxes everywhere. You guys ever been to a gas station at like 3 a.m. or something? I'm not going to lie. It's a whole vibe and I'm, I'm all here for it. So this is exactly what it's reminding me of. What do you guys think? Soaps, gas, so we got scaps, gas, and grub. I used to work at a gas station. The gas station's closed. Okay. Gas station's uh, crossroads. Is this the other new map? I do not remember crossroads being inside of running from the internet, but I do remember crossroads being and every other f***ing Xbox game on the platform. Most of the items in the game, not all of them, but like most of the items, literally, oh, it does say here, literally every item has been rebalanced. Each of the items in the game do something completely different. That could be from damage to knockback to even price or the travel speed of, of some items or even the radius. Like there's a, there's a lot of things that they did with the items here. The next bots have been fully remastered. So let's see here. They're now faster, they're more deadly, and they spawn significantly more. Can now be killed for good? Ooh. So when you kill a next bot and running from the internet now, they don't respawn. You just kill them. I actually like that change. I'm not gonna lie. That's a pretty good change because normally you would just stun them. Instead of stunning a next bot so they just sit there, then you can like rack up points by people just spamming the dead next bot and then also stunning them even more. It got pretty repetitive and annoying. So this is a good fix. It, it makes it more competitive, especially when they boosted the deadly and the spawn or next bots. I just said deadly like that was an adjective. I mean, it is an adjective, but I used it like a verb. Yeah, that's not how that works. Oh, by the way, that trailer was made by Staria987. Let's go ahead and check out the Crossroads map. Hey, ooh, this this Crossroads makes me feel like I'm a f attack on Titan Giant or some shit. What is this? I feel like a giant right now. Woohoo! She, let's do that one more time, ladies. Ooh, we got a plane. I want to try to kill the next bot. So let me try to kill one. They don't have like a health, so you can't really see. But I really want to kill the next bots here. Here, blow up. What the fuck was that? He walked right over the landmine. Oh, can I jump up here? Oh, yeah. Sucks for you guys. You can't even get up here. Are they stuck down there? Or can they actually climb up? Oh, fuck. I fell. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Get back up. Get back up. Get back up where they can't. They can't get up here. They can't get up here. They can't. Ah! Go climb the ladder. Oh, my God. I got so scared that I accidentally pulled up the settings menu. Okay, well, I really didn't get a chance to actually view the crossroads map. I didn't even get a chance to kill the next bots either. Like, there was tasks I was supposed to do, and I, I couldn't do them. You could tell I'm a professional player at video games. We'll play one more map because I really want to kill the next bots. I'm not psychotic. I don't want to put the ban hammer on. Yeah, let's put the ban. Okay, never mind. Yeah, fuck me then. This one better not run through the mine, I swear to God. Yeah, there we go. Matter of fact, get hit with a f***ing plane. Here, hang on. Making a round two, mother- I, I can't kill them. I can't kill the next bots. I, I can't kill the next bots. Oh! Get f- So yeah, you, you do kill the next bots. That's dope. And it makes a little sound effect when you do kill them as well, so you know. Oh, see? Just like that. Duh, baby. More like you're f***ing dead. For those who haven't played Running From The Internet, I highly suggest you go ahead and take action to this game because it's very underrated. It's very underrated. If you guys are into, like, fast-paced fighting games and you love the next bot genre, this is definitely the game for you. I haven't played it as much as I used to before, but I'll have to hop into it more now that they actually went ahead and redid the whole next bots first player thing because I like that you can kill the next bots. You can't just spam them anymore. We'll have to grind our way to level 100 because it looks like the max isn't level 70 anymore. But anyways, guys, that's pretty much going to be it for me. My name is JMT, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out, guys.